Hi, Fire Signs. I'm here to do your weekly breakdowns uh, Monday through Sunday, the 4th to the 10th. We're going to break down each day for you guys. Why do I feel like you guys are partying this week? You guys are in like party mode. So, Sag, Leo, Aries. This middle one's going to be your overall energy for the week. We got Monday, we got Tuesday, we got Wednesday. We got Thursday, we got Friday, we got Saturday, and we got Sunday. Let's see what's going on. Remember, general readings are not going to resonate with everybody. Um, in the extended, I'm also going to be doing like breakdowns via each sign. So if you're interested in that, head on over. But otherwise, we're going to see what y'all's overall energy is for all the fire signs. All right, overall energy of the week. Five of Swords in reverse. If you've had any conflicts or arguments, you are coming out of that right now. Yeah, the moon. I feel like you guys just don't give an F. If somebody's been, like, bringing conflict in your life, you don't give a shit. You don't give a shit, fire signs. You I-D-A-G-F. I don't give up. You really don't. <laughs> Y'all be doing you. All right, Monday, Two of Pentacles. Ooh, 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 and the Four of Cups. Hmm. Um, you guys might be in fights with, like, significant others, with, like, business partners. I don't know. Um, had you in a type of energy. But, like, the overall energy is you getting, like, you not giving a shit. I do see arguments here. There being some kind of argument, some kind of argument that, like, puts you in a bad mood. But I feel like your overall energy is like, bitch, don't kill my vibe. Don't kill my vibe. Tuesday. Ace of Swords. Somebody gonna say something to you. What is this Ace of Swords doing here? And the Five of Pentacles in reverse. Somebody gonna say something to you about like, why aren't you talking to me? Some of my fire signs are like, instead of dealing with conflict, you guys are out like living it up. Somebody, now I see somebody's like in this depression mode towards you. Either that's somebody or you guys are going to communicate this with somebody like, uh, hello, where the hell are you? What the hell's going on? But I really feel like this is somebody coming towards you to like have a confrontation with you. Because I feel like y'all be living it up right now. Um, Wednesday, the death card, the end of something. Some of you guys could be getting... Going through some changes. Yeah, the Three of Pentacles. So the end of... And victory. I don't know if somebody's like fed up with the behavior or you're fed up with somebody's behavior and you're just like, I'm out. Like, I'm moving on. I'm going to take the L, but I'm out. Um, which is the energy I'm feeling. I feel like the first two days of the week, like there's a lot of tension. Lots of tension. There's going to be a communication probably like an argument or something um or somebody just kind of coming forth and being like hey why haven't you been talking to me why have you been like so distant um why are you being difficult and you're just gonna be like I don't care I don't care and it might be like this person's like all right well then I'm done like I think you're gonna come to a finality of something here could be in regards to your career, it could be a relationship, because the two of pentacles being here, it could be some like work partnership or something that you're just tired of like putting energy towards, you don't want this conflict, you don't want this issues anymore, and like this person's kind of like, you damn done with this person, or whatever situation it is, alright, so Thursday, eight of wands, are y'all going on vacation, you guys going on vacation fire sign? The magician. Somebody's coming in. Somebody's coming in with some communication. Communicating that they want a new beginning. Be careful though because the magician is in reverse. So could be a little trickster energy. Could be a little trickster energy. But somebody's either traveling. You're going on vacation. Um, or somebody's sending you a message. Somebody might be sending you a message. A little bit of trickster energy. Just be aware. Be aware. Be very, very aware. Friday. The sun card in reverse. Hmm. And the two of swords. Making a decision. A decision regarding what? 
um, the Four of Wands. So whoever's coming in and communicating with you, I feel like you, they could be somebody from your past that you feel like is your soulmate, is your twin flame that you have this deep connection with. Um, they've disappointed you in the past, but I feel like you're still going to be contemplating it. We're just remember that that magician is in reverse. So for me, that's uh, a little bit of trickster energy, especially with the Mercury retrograde. Don't make any hasty decisions because a lot of people's energies are going to be out of whack. So you might see people coming back from the past offering stuff, but as soon as Mercury goes direct, they could be out for the count. All right, so Saturday, judgment in reverse. Why is this here? Nave of Wands. I feel like you guys are working on yourselves this weekend. Maybe uh, working on some new passion. There's the devil card. Mm, some of you guys might be connecting with this past person, having like a little passionate love affair, and then it's going to be over just as soon as it started. So just be aware. You guys might have like a little lustful weekend. Y'all might be partying this weekend. You guys might be partying some of you guys might be like having one night stands is what I'm seeing. I don't know. But I don't think you're. It, this isn't serious. You guys are just out having fun. Y'all could be partying a lot this weekend. Ace of Cups in reverse for Sunday. And then the Star card. Um, hmm. Why? And the Ten of Cups. So Sunday... You guys went from having this little romp to uh, Sunday, you're in love, emotionally fulfilled, you've got your wish fulfillment. Um, I don't know why this Ace of Cups is in reverse, because uh, you could be holding back starting this new beginning, because there's somebody you're waiting for that you feel like is going to make you happy, or like you hold back on some new beginning, because this weekend you might meet somebody really spectacular. Uh, you might meet somebody. Y'all might be meeting somebody this weekend, so be open to it. If you're not online dating, maybe get on like Hinge or Bumble or something because there's potential to meet somebody. The energy for you guys to meet somebody this weekend, very, very high. Very, very high. Fire sign. Because you're going to be out partying. You're going to be living it up. You drop in the conflict. This new moon, I feel like you've manifested this new person. And they're going to come. They're going to come. So the energy's out there this weekend. So put yourself out there is what I'm seeing, fire sign. All right. So the extended, I'm going to be breaking down each sign, <clears throat> um, explaining what's going on for the week and doing like a little rundown. So if you're interested in that, click the, click the link in the description box. And I'll see you there. Bye.